Hi, I'm Ehsas, and this is my sister Mehr. Who cries on stage? ये क्या होता है? What is this? इससे क्या हो रहा है? ये मैं होगी सोच रहा हूँ। She looks very weird. And she cries. Sorry. Hello and welcome to yet another episode of Behind the Spoken Story. This is Tess welcoming you to an episode which is kind of sassy and kind of cute and kind of cool because those are all the things that she believes she is. This is Esas telling us about her spoken story. This was actually the first time I went on stage and talked. I usually, I never done this. I've either danced or either like I've performed, I've done a piece, but I've never really gone and spoken. This was like the first time I was doing it and again the stage fear came in. So I was also like, will people relate to this or will people understand this? But I really believed in the story, I really believed in you guys. It's really lovely for you to be honest about you have stage fright and that you feel nervous. And is there something you do? I pray a little bit uh, to God only. Else. <laughs> I don't think anything helps. Like <laughs> the moment I went on stage, I was very nervous. Like I, I can hear a shiver in my voice, and my hands were like, I, I made a mistake. Remember, I, I fumbled a little bit. People cheered for me. I think that really eased me into it even more. But I think I was nervous till my last word. How are we going to show him away? How are we going to show the crow away? There he is. Now he's quiet. I think of getting like a water gun to like push it. Got to go. oh. If you had to pick, which story would maybe you have picked? I was really happy that you guys picked it on my behalf and it really worked well and I'm really glad that we went for the uh, sister story and I feel that because I have spoken about my childhood and being a child actor in school and a lot of interviews and people know about these things. Intentionally after my uh, performance, I went and I attended the whole thing so that I meet people and I get like a response about how they felt and I had touch wood so many people so many girls came up to me and saying that we loved your story we could relate to it and there was this one girl who had come with her sister and both of them came and they were crying we could completely relate to you thank you for saying this and I was just so happy and there was this other dude who came to me and said you are famous so you are your sister now I have to meet your sister it was fun for uh people to see you for you, mm -hmm. you know, and yeah. uh, I think that's one thing that we loved watching, but give me three things which are quintessentially SS. Being sensitive and being bubbly and cute. Being cute, I guess. <laughs> the cool has been thrown out yeah. the building. Oh my God, Shant, there was a question. Ah. One, yes. one question just for the camera, which is uh, you purposely mispronounce your surname. What? That's this the story about this that. This is a trap. We found this, this out. This man. It is because my name is Channa and I've had I've grown up with people calling me hey, Channa Vatana, hey, Channa Channa Singh. <laughs> so school mein, this has only happened and then there was a song called uh, Channa Vekhar Aja Ve. That song uh, was dreadful and then uske dasal saal baad ye gaana aage Channa Mere Aage. तो खत्म ही नहीं हो रहा है ये सिलसिला दिस कीप्स हैपी अभी दस साल बाद अब कोई और आएगा चन्ना तेरे या तो फिर देन यू विल नॉट जस्ट इट विल कीप गोइंग सो देन आई वाज लाइक चन्ना नहीं है मेरा नाम पहली बार तो मेरा नाम चान्ना है व्हिच इज दिस इज जस्ट नॉट ट्रू इट इज चन्ना ओनली बट आई कॉल इट चान्ना सो दैट पीपल जस्ट टॉप वी आर गोइंग टू प्ले माय फेवरेट गेम व्हिच इज द रैपिड फायर राउंड इट इज नॉट के जो बट इट इज टी जो सो अगर आप एक शहर होती तो विच शहर वुड यू बी एंड वाई मैं मुंबई होती हूँ मुझे लगता है आई ग्रोन अप योर एंड मुंबई इज वेरी केयोटिक एंड आई एम अ वेरी केयोटिक पर्सन अगर आप एक सुपर हीरो होती तो आपका सुपर पार कौन सा होता लोगों का दिन बनाना विथ माई चार्म And if you were a color, बच्चा पे बच्चा गुलाबी ये तो baby talk में बोलना पड़ेगा ना ना baby pink कुछ Tell me three things that scare you. First thing is losing my mother. It scares me every day. Just the thought of it is just I have 
I have certain goals in my head that I have to do this. I have to become this. And it also comes from my mother's uh, dream that she really wants me to become a an actress, a good actress. Not being able to fulfill her dream, to put it in easiest terms. Uh, being alone. So tell us one thing that you do, you keep doing, but you kind of suck at. I sing, but I know I sing very badly. But I sing very confidently. Like I know I'm I'm hitting the right wrong surs. I'm <laughs> गलत मैं अलाप गलत जगह ले लेती हूँ तो मुझे पता है एंड आई आई नो आई माई सेंस ऑफ ह्यूमर सक्स आई क्रैक रियली लेम जोक्स बट आई स्टिल डू इट बिकॉज एंड एंड पीपल आर लाइक यू आर वेरी लेम आई मै मैं हंसी ना खुद ब्रो मैं खुद को हंसाया ना चलेगा <laughs> अगर आप एक कारो की सॉन्ग हो विच सॉन्ग वुड यू बी आई वुड बी एनी टेलर स्विफ्ट सॉन्ग राइट नाउ आई वुड बी एंटी हीरो बाई टेलर स्विफ्ट इट्स मी हाई I'm the problem. It's me. At tea time, everybody agrees. Is there a quote or lyrics to a song which you go back to in your head because they kind of like do something for you? If it's not happy, it's not the end. Because there's always a happy ending. If you think that this is the end, if it's not happy, then it's not the end. It always is a happy ending. Always believe that. If it makes you happy, that's where. it would end or that is like that is when you get a closure but if it's not happy if it's making you angry or sad then it's not the end you remember the first character you saw on screen or read in a book and you said i want to play this character who would that be i know um, every line of geet from javi met kisi socha tha main ratlam ki galiyon mein ghum rahi hu ye ghar ye galiyan zindagi kamal hai hai na i know every line of hers that is a character that i want to do but i feel like i have done that i have played a bubbly girl but now i uh, think flee bag uh i i really i love that character i love the way it's written i love phoebe waller bridge um i want to do something like that for sure and what's your favorite geet dialogue from sabina main apni favorite hu pani bahut acha lag raha hai na wo pyar mein thi all is very love and war Show us your screen time. Oh my God! But you're gonna guess it before you show it to us. You want me to open yeah, it? Yeah, I don't know where. Oranges, sorry, I don't know why I went to oranges. Search. We are rolling all of this because this seems to be the way we feel like. Comp- I did this last time. It can't be so hard to do. It, it is weekly or daily? Daily. Daily. Oh, daily. So then it will be uh, three hours. What? <laughs> Five hours. Bring it to the camera. We Let the camera see. This. Don't tell this to my mother, please, guys. You realize it's going to be in the oh, video. Oh shit, she's going to see this. Shanzulu, yeah, please, na, don't, na. But she will watch it anyway. Yeah. But what does love look like for you? Love looks like happiness to me, but I, it also has to. I need to be very, very comfortable with the person. I need. I should be able to tell the person everything. Uh, my deepest fears, my deepest flaws. Uh, even if I've committed the worst crime, I should be able to tell that person, and without the fear that I will be judged. It doesn't look like baby talk. Yes, baby talk. Yeah, it looks like. I actually, oh, yeah, it looks like baby talk. I've I've started baby talking more after spoken. I feel like I baby talk all the time. And mom, mom is like, can you talk normally for one minute? It's a problem. She's I don't be surprised my mom takes me to a doctor. My favorite line of this entire interview has been main apni favorite hu. So if commune is your favorite, you know what to do. You just need to like, like, subscribe and share. Like you're there everywhere. See you next week.